tutorial on how to play five seconds of summer wants you back. We're in standard tuning, no capo. We've got an E minor chord, an A minor chord, a G chord, and an F open chord or an F bar chord, whatever you prefer to play. If you know how to play those chords, go ahead and skip ahead. For now, I'll be teaching you how to play those. We're going to start out here nice and easy with our A minor chord. You're going to be on your first fret of your B string. That's your second string up, one, two strings up with your index finger. Third string down, that's your D string. One, two, three strings down. With your middle finger, you are going to play on the second fret of your D string. Ring finger gets tucked right under on the second fret of the G. And we are going to play these five strings. We're not gonna play our low E here, just these five strings. To get to your F from this shape, you can leave your index finger in the same position Move your middle finger down to the 2nd fret of the G string. Ring finger goes up to the 3rd fret of the A. That's your 2nd string down. 1, 2 strings down. And you're over on the 3rd fret. And your pinky goes on the 3rd fret of the D, tucked right under. Be careful not to play your high E string here, or your low E string. Just these 4 strings. And there's your F open. So we've got our A minor, our F open. Now let's talk about our G chord here. G chord, your ring finger is going to go to the 3rd fret of the high E string, that's your bottom most string, all the way over on the 3rd fret here. Middle finger goes to the 3rd fret of the low E, that's the opposite side of this finger. And your index is on the 2nd fret of the A, that's the 2nd string down. And for your G chord, you play all 6 strings. And finally, we have an E minor chord. For your E minor, you can place your middle finger on the 2nd fret of the A string, 2nd string down, and your ring finger gets tucked under on the 2nd fret of the D. You play all 6 strings. So those are the chords we need to know. Let's talk about the progression now. So the verse progression sounds like this. So it goes A minor, to your G, to your F, Oops, sorry. From your G to your E minor to your F. A minor, G, E minor, F. It's not too bad, so one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, A minor, two, G, four, E minor, two, F, four. And that is how simple the verse is. It's very simple. And then the chorus sounds like this. It starts on an F. So it's a little more complicated, but we're gonna break it down here. So start on your F open chord. And we're gonna go strum like this. So down, down, up, 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 switch to your G chord, down, 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 up, 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 down, up, down, 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 up, 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 down. go to our E minor chord and do the same thing. E minor to your F. So F G E minor F F G minor to F. And that's it. So that is going to be it for this tutorial. If you have questions, feel free to comment below. If you'd like to see more tutorials, please subscribe to my channel. Thank you for watching.